for all you Cronus users that are dealing with team members that want unpaid time off this is the proper way to add time off I'm gonna choose in this particular team members account I'm gonna choose um, let's pick Monday the 4th of January 2016 this particular column here which is called the time off column we need to know the reason why we are requesting time off if you click on the magnifying glass here this particular case here we're using unpaid time off and then you want to put how many hours they should have worked for that unpaid time off which in this case here is eight and the reason why the question marks are here is because we have not saved so once we save that let's go back down to the fourth here we can see here that unpaid time off is now saved without any kind of a numeric value in here the unpaid time off will not save main reason is if we scroll up here and we look at summary by day in this tab area here we can see there was a previous time that they had requested time off which is on the 30th of December and then the date we just set up here on January 4th it will have a cumulative total there so we now have a reporting feature to show how many unpaid days have been taken by a particular employee keeping that separate from the raw and calculated totals it does not calculate in these areas here at all So we can see in the summary by date that we've got raw totals, calculated totals, which are calculating all values in here, including unpaid time off. But when we go to the calc summary, we can see to date there's a holiday day that needs to be paid. There's the two unpaid time off, the one we created and the one previous on the 30th plus this person's only worked one day so this is what the pay categories would look like here noticing that the unpaid time off is not calculating in the regular time any questions please contact your manager or your ID department at Able Dental Group Dennis here signing off